Okay, so uh, I had some problems last time with this, but uh, um, uh, moving on, I, I guess I missed a couple of days at the end, that's all. Um, so the end of, end of the summer, uh, Larkin went on his trip, and then uh, we got basically Anna and, oh yeah, he, he got a loose tooth. He got his first loose tooth earlier, and then it, that one came out, and then he's got another one just, just yesterday. So um, anyway, so Anna is reading her magic book, and um, is most of the way through that, if not finished with it. Uh, we got to return it. It's like way super late, it's still sitting at home. And then uh, playing in the pool some more. And having, then we had a fun lunch outside. I think that might have been uh, Saturday, Sunday. Oh, yeah, that was fun. We had a windy day and we figured out use the hematite magnet rocks to keep, keep them on the table, which was metallic. And you see music playing in the background. So, it's kind of fun letting the kids run around while we would play. So this is Anna off to camp. So she's all packed in her luggage and she's got a backpack ready to go. And okay, so she's she's headed off to camp. And back at home with the kids. So um, so I just went to Idaho Falls to drop Anna off the, the first time. And um, eventually I'll head back and pick her up um, in in Boise. So um, this is Larkin on what appears to be the last day of school. Um, looks, looks like well, I must have downloaded these like after he got back because this is way past the last day of school. So there, Grafford visited their their thing that he's he had a couple of days of preschool and then um, went to their field day or whatever. And Larkin gave him a big headlock hug. And this is them at, on their hike. Um, <laughs> Logan figuring out how to use scissors. Um, food motivates this kid so much you wouldn't even believe. So he, he's learned how to do all sorts of things because there's food involved. So this is him opening up the package for food. Um, making party pizzas. You see, he's got he's got the pan all set up ready over there. And he's making party pizzas. And he did. He did. He ate party pizza that day. And feeding Braylon. Oh, that's a fun animation. Anna trying out the different flavors of soda. There's one, one, I don't remember what the different brands are, but they're both like supposed to be orange frosty. <laughs> so she picked up that I was taking pictures of her, but this is us, this is me. I, I drove all the way over to Boise and then um, um, stayed overnight with Catherine and Steve. And then thank you, Catherine and Steve. Um, and then woke up in the morning and went and picked her up in Cascade, which is a really long ways away. And then basically, um, that's about as far as you can get from either of the routes home. So it was faster for me to just go to Cascade and then keep coming through the middle of Idaho than it was to go back around the other way. So we spent all the rest of the day driving, which was kind of fun. Stopped off at Lolo Pass, um, did a little hike up there. That was kind of fun. And then uh, um, Lolo Pass, that was fun. You are here. That's where we were. Went so um, this is back in Bozeman. The uh, Museum of the Rockies is doing a, a guitar exhibit. They got a, a guitar manufacturer there, but I, it sounded like they were maybe closing down or something. But anyway, they've got the museum going on. Um, this is upstairs. The boys didn't want to watch the guitars; they wanted to play. This is one of my favorite places. So Anna, this is a gift shop at the guitar museum. Um, Anna holding Braylon, talking to her mom. Those are pretty eyes, huh? Oh, this was the coolest candle I've ever seen. You light one and then they, um, they like it lights a fuse and lights them all and then it flies open, spins and sings happy birthday. Um, kind of terrifying actually, but it was fun. Um, yeah, so that's, that's gotta be, it's gotta be Grafford's birthday, but anyway, everybody's taking turns blowing out the candle. Um, Anna, we celebrated, well, maybe that was, we celebrated Anna's birthday early. So this is for Anna's birthday. We, we, um, we got her, we got her, uh, a, a pioneer chest. So we blindfolded her and I tried to get her lost so she wouldn't know where we were and then took her outside and showed her. She thought that was fun. And then we got her a phone. So, um, then this is Grafford for his birthday being sent to a primary Berlin. Boy, we're gonna get haul in here. Um, so I'm gonna skip a bunch of these and just kind of scroll through them. Well, Grafford got his 
his cozy coop and everybody wanted to take a turn, right? Even Larkin, he just barely, barely fits, but there you go. Okay, so um, shortly after we planned our vacation, um, I was called to be the 11, uh, an 11-year-old 11 scout leader with John Blanchard. And I love working with John Blanchard. Um, and I love camping with the scouts. Um, it just kind of took me by surprise. And we, we, we took, we, we, I had taken like Friday and Saturday off to go on vacation, but we used those days instead. And I, I, we took the boys up to um, highlight. So that's how our family vacation started is dad went to camp with the boys. So this is camp. So I'm going to skip over much of that because I love these guys. They are the, the audience for this video is for my family. And then you don't probably know these guys. So I'm going to skip. It was fun. It was a lot of fun. There they are. We made, we made pancakes for the like, like dessert pancakes with cake batter mix in the pancake mix for, a lot of a lot of those pictures. So let's get through here. Okay, we'll have to do a video on the the boys sometime too. Um, it rained. Enough said. Uh, this is back home, so we're getting packed up, ready to go. And I found a rainbow because it had rained a bunch. Um, here we are at church. Um, uh, Anna was teaching me how to play guitar, and then um, pretty soon here. So yay, Anna, teaching Logan how to blow bubbles in a chocolate milk as if he didn't know, but teaching new skills, right? And then, uh, um, okay, so this is us. So, so we drove down to Salt Lake and we, this is us at the top of the church headquarters building and there's a really pretty view from up there. And um, us in front of the Salt Lake Temple. And Grafford was just having a rough time. We had to keep him in the chair for a lot of, we went and we saw a bunch of the the new uh, Meet the Mormons films, which is kind of cool. Um, the temple Square and on the steps of the temple. And then the Mormon Tabernacle Choir sings here at the Conference Center. A bunch of really cool art in the Conference Center. It's a big place. It holds like 25,000 people. Um, taking pictures with um, President Monson, who's passed away. They've got a bust of him. Um, and then outside on the conference center, um, I don't think Larkin believed us that we were like on top of a building, but we were. And then uh, uh, at the reflection pond. Okay, so I, this is the mall nearby and I uh, can't remember why we started there but anyway we, I think it was just for lunch or something but and but spent, the kids spent a lot of time playing in this little playground which is really kind of cool so they spent a lot of time there that was fun yeah that was one of the very funnest unplanned parts of the vacation was this that playground okay so then we're back here at um, this is the church headquarters building um, went to the uh, uh, discovery museum downtown that was cool Grafford fixing a jeep uh, Anna playing with the kids being best sister she says put, putting Grafford up on the saddle with her Logan Berlin they, they had this little store and Larkin was making sandwiches and he was really loving making sandwiches. Then everybody wanted to come over and play and kept on putting his, like staff kept on putting his sandwiches away. And finally he's like, you know what? I'm done. I just can't take it anymore. But he spent, he spent a couple of hours being the sandwich maker at, in this village there. It was kind of fun. Um, this is Larkin hanging out with pictures of all the former uh, presidents, former uh, general authorities, the church. Some of this is mixed in, I think it must be because it came from a couple different cameras or something like that. So not in chronological order, apparently, obviously. Um, still at the yeah, museum and the temple and conference center and lunch and playing. Um, we spent a lot of our, our day playing at the museum. Um, this, this was at Applebee's. I think dad went out and was, was dancing with the boys looking for diapers or something. Um, 
you recognize that. That's at uh, we, this is we fed the giraffes at the Hogel Zoo. So we started the summer with the uh, Tapas Park Zoo, and then this is Hogel polar bear feeding the giraffes. Here's Logan, Larkin. Crawford was in there too. There we go. That was fun. Ta -da. And then uh, on the train, that was the that was the way to see the zoo. If you're going to see the zoo, see it on a train in the shade, not having to walk. Um, we saved that for last. Uh, when at lunch there, lunch was way too expensive, but um, it was fun. And this is checking into the hotel, kids taking a ride, and then again, some of the pictures are mixed in chronologically. Um, and I don't even, oh yeah, and then we went to um, Dinosaur National Park. So this is a wall that's covered in fossils, I don't know if you can tell, but like these dinosaurs fossils, they let you reach out and touch them. That's kind of cool. And we spent a lot of time there, and there's a couple of hikes we could have gone on, but I just really, really wasn't interested in the idea of taking a bunch of little kids on a hike. I turned into a pansy in my old age. We'll get there one of these days. Maybe they'll get bigger another couple of years and we'll we'll try again. So these are the petroglyphs. So you can kind of see in the background there's like there's like you know thousand year old drawing or something. Um, we got dinosaurs at the gift shop and then again more petroglyphs. Um <laughs> like we walked all the way up and there was like one petroglyph and he's like you mean you made me hike up here for nothing? Anyway, so um, me and Braylon, um, this is this is this is the dinosaur museum in, in Ogden. It seems like it is. This I really love this museum. Um, there's you know upstairs there's a bunch of let's see is that what this is? Up, upstairs there's a bunch of rocks in uh, in the exhibit, and I I thought that was really cool. Um, this is not Ogden. This is Vernal. So this is Vernal. Um, we did go to another dinosaur museum in, in Ogden. So this was the, the summer of the dinosaurs. So the boys seeing the dinosaurs and Anna outside of the Stegosaurus. Pterodactyls and puzzles and we ate at Sonic. We've not been as impressed with Sonic recently, but it was tasty. Um, hanging out at another museum. We, we just kind of, we didn't even plan to go to Vernal. Like, like we didn't plan our plan when we went to Vernal, but we kept on finding things to do every day. So it was kind of neat. Um, they loved the phone. They had a fight to take turns. There's Grafford running. Sorry if it doesn't make me dizzy. I'm trying to get through these fast. So we went swimming a couple of times. So this was kind of fun. So, so, so Sunday, it must have been after church. Um, I said, well, you know what? Let's go on this hike. I'm, I'm finally going to be not a pansy. We've got all day. Let's go on this hike. We ran into like some hot shots, um, uh, fighting fires, and they're like, uh, "You're gonna need some water." And so I don't know if that's what that was. This might be, might have been just our picnic. I can't remember what day this was, but um, we did go on a hike, and, and they're like, "Yeah, you need some water." So they gave us a bunch of water. Um, uh, Mom doing laundry. Uh, this is again. This is the hike on the way down to go see the um, the Diplodocus uh, footprints which was kind of cool. Um, there, there's one, you can't, I don't know, you can't really see it from here, but you, when you're standing there, you really, really can see it. They're, they're like, they're like obvious. Um, there's one kind of down there that didn't quite make it in the frame. And then one back there behind Janae, you can see it really good. Anyway, dinosaur footprints. You're gonna walk in dinosaur footprints. So not even very far away, there, there's a cliff and, and, oh, there's another one. People are cliff jumping. And so like just off to the right, like right there, people are jumping off the cliff and I'm like, Eek, I don't want my kids over there. So it was hard enough to get them there. It was like maybe, I don't know, 30 minute walk. I don't know, maybe three miles or something like that with up and downs and rocks and kids screaming and stuff like that. So yeah, it happens. Um, beautiful, beautiful landscape there though. Beautiful girl hanging out with a handsome dude. Berlin. <laughs> so we stopped to use the bathroom and the bathroom was locked, but Logan figured it out. <laughs> so um, this is kind of a cool landscape. 
And this was, I mean, this is a uh, dinosaur national park. So like most of the park, there's like a building that's, that's dinosaur bones. And then the rest of it is just pretty dry. And so we went and had a picnic there and um, Jenny slept and the kids played on their iPads and dad drove. So um, good times. Picnic. Yeah. <laughs> this is Anna. I don't know if she was sleeping or pretending to be asleep, but we had mm, more fun than a parent should have with diapers and kids' heads. This is us at the Ogden Dinosaur Museum. They had an exhibit outside and then one inside. And these are the rocks I was talking about that are really awesome. I don't know how they ended up collecting so many really valuable minerals. Um, that's really kind of a cool collection. Us hanging outside at the dinosaur park, playing in the playground there. And then there's kind of a pond there. And yeah, basically driving around, getting out of Vernal, Ogden, I mean. Um, that kind of wrapped up our, well, it didn't because we ended up, we went up and we had uh, dinner with uh, Rob while we were on our way through. We stayed at a hotel there, um, beautiful hotel. We went swimming. Um, we started our vacation, I don't have pictures of it, but we started at, at, at what we thought would be a cool hotel with a swimming pool, but it wasn't that great. It had a slide, but it wasn't as good as the one in Billings. And then it was like the Holiday Inn Express over there at the, uh, over at the Decker Drive, Decker Lake Drive. It wasn't as good. Um, but then the stay in Ogden on the way back through was with points and it was free and it was a cool hotel. So that was fun. Um, so then we actually spent a couple nights at Warm River. So um, Carolyn and Brian met us up there. Um, Matt kept our truck for a um, uh, couple of days. Um, Matt doesn't know that I know that they took the truck up to the dunes, but if he watches this video, he'll know I knew. Um, and then we hung out at Warm River and float of the river, that was kind of fun. Um, and there's the kids playing in the pond. Larkin kept on trying to jump in and it would tip over the, we kept on trying to not be in the water because the water was really cold. We wanted to make sure we floated, but we, we were gonna do the, the, the fireworks later. Um, so we, we'd floated in the morning and he didn't want to touch the water because it was so cold. And so we ended up flipping a couple of times. And finally it was warm enough to float by the time we, Finally got out, but this is a good one. Look, he's in the air. <clears throat> and then, anyway, so spent some time just lounging around, doing camping, cleaned up the camp. We got off to, um, we went and had the uh, music in the park and Driggs. And oh, we fed the fish. I forgot about that part. And then um, this is music in the park and Driggs. Look at, I love that picture. Isn't she cute? Um, the kid that they, they put out bubbles for the kids and chalk and they it was fun they fought over it most of the time but look at that they're having a blast so yeah take your kids up to Driggs sometime you know it takes the same amount of time to drive back from Idaho Falls to Rexburg as it does from Driggs to Rexburg it's just you're not in traffic so longer distance no traffic well not much traffic yet because then people will see my video and totally go right so um, it's kind of fun because they do the little concert music in the park thing and um, happy 4th of July. So this is the 4th of July. And then it seems like we went back to camp. So like we went and saw the fireworks and then we went back to camp and then Carolyn and Brian just booked at home. And then I guess Brian worked the next morning. I don't even know how he survived. It was such a late night. That's fun. So doing fireworks. And then we had, we brought a bunch of like little sticks from the store and shared them with the kids. I like that one little tricks you can do with Janae's camera and that's it so again hanging out in the park oh yeah we went to the museum like in, in Idaho Falls this is the uh, Idaho History Museum and then dressed up and had a really interesting experience with these kids um long story short it just 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 they they just seemed like they were uncomfortable being there and um anyway 
but they hung out with our kids and then this is upstairs again they just love playing pretend in these those kind of play areas and then we took Anna out to dinner and we had a big dinner at um, oh anyway a steakhouse in Idaho Falls and then Lark had doing puppet shows our last night in the hotel so we stayed we stayed in Idaho Falls on the river and then um, played at we just you know stuff left over to be waiting for Anna to go home we played at the um blast off i think it's blast off anyway in idaho falls yep five four three two fun i remember now it was blast off and so then anna's getting ready to go home to her moms were playing in the arcades and and i i invited her to go play in the arcade afterwards she's like no it's kind of a thing that i do with my brothers and not really into the arcade sort of thing oh this is the hotel the night before um so no, thank you. Um, take me to the movies. And so we went and we watched uh, Ant Man versus Wasp. And then this is there's a kind of an acoustic like like audio reverberation place at Edwards Theater, and she was laughing. She's like, "That's really cool." And so that was it. And then Grafford got um, a gift from Grandma, and that was the end of our summer. And uh, well, it wasn't nearly the end of our summer. We took we took Anna home for the summer, and then. Um, uh, kind of off for a week and then back for a week and then there was more summer more camps more fun um, but uh, that's kind of the highlights and it's really really late so this was fun um, I'll have to do it again but I gotta go to bed thanks stop sharing stop recording and I'll see you later